Just a few more thoughts on the Idaho case. I get asked a lot if I think this is connected to any other case or if this is a serial. And saying it up front, I don't have anything more than you do. All I know is what's in the news. The scene says an experience to me. That there was a focus of the attack and it was personal. Not planned well. Six versus one in the house, including a male. That I'm betting he didn't know was there. The choice of weapon, a large hunting knife. A utility knife made for hunting and survival, not necessarily dispatching people. Looking through history, there are better edged weapons than that. The dad said the injuries were like large cleaver marks. The power that that takes is probably a male. The impact is also going to spread a lot of evidence. Not only of the victim, but the bad guy too. I saw on the news somebody saying toxicology is not important. Well, maybe. Alcohol would be no surprise. But with all the counterfeit drugs coming across the border, that might be a lead. Because different batches will be unique. If nothing else, it's evidence worth running down. Having a medical examiner to help the coroner will be useful. As always, be safe.